What's up, fam bam? It is your girl, Blue Phoenix, and we're back with another message today. This is a collective reading, so you could be of any sun, sign, moon, Venus, Ra, anything, all right? If the title, the thumbnail uh, stuck out to you or called you, it, there may be a message here for you, okay? All right, we got some sort of fate, mystery, destiny at play here, all right? Feminine energy, definitely. The number 14 could be significant for you. And on the bottom of the deck, you have AYs with the horse. All right. The number, what was that? 14 or the number 19 could be significant. So the number 10, the number one, zero or five. All right. All right. And we got the rune of communication here as well. Ansus. All right. Interesting. Insight, vision, signs, communication, knowledge, Odin's wisdom. All right. And this one says progress, harmony, movement, trust, loyalty, duality, assistance, animal instincts, and friendships. Okay. We got destiny here. All right. All the spirit will be to Oh, well, damn. Come on, the magician. All right. Gemini energy on the board. All right. Just doing a little, little pre-shuffle real quick for you here collective. Okay. Don't forget to hit that like button for your girl. Definitely hit the subscribe button if you're new here and you want to receive more messages like this every day. Ashe. Ashe. Oh, the gift of love. All right. So you got, you're destined for some sort of overflow of love. Okay. Bitch. Let's get into it, Holy Spirit. What's on the bottom? Shit, ninja. Fuck. <laughs> Damn devil. Capricorn it could be significant, okay? All right. You could be wondering obsessively for some of y'all about love, okay? Or a king of cups could be Pisces, Scorpio, Cancer. Pick up what resonates. Put this energy where it goes for your timeline. We're reading for the entire collective, right? So everything may not resonate, but pick up what's for you. If you need a personal reading, I do offer those. All readings retire within three to five days. All right, but if you need a same day reading, you can reach out to Keen. They are offering five minutes for one dollar right now okay so all the information will be listed down below in the description box or in the pinned comment okay all right so we have pisces scorpio cancer capricorn energy here all right aquarius libra gemini somebody's got love on the mind baby all right all right all right holy spirit <laughs> tell me about this love please messages for the collective here today please something could have been at a standstill for you look in the eight of cups on the bottom of the deck look you got ice here okay all right it says stone cold block wounded okay you could be in a, a, a period of healing right now so you could have uh <laughs> you could have um shit what am i trying to say like not blocked off any love or you know people that want to show you love and things like that but you could have like this card says it says spend time alone in nature meditating about your desires and intentions ask the angels to help you gain a positive perspective you could be in this mode right now or be coming out of it okay to where you weren't open to any love or you know, new friends, new love or anything like that, right? Because it don't have to, love don't have to necessarily be romantic. This could be, what is it called? Oh my gosh, brotherly love, philos, philos love, okay, agape love. I don't know, all them words coming to me, okay? Rima, Rima word, like all the, I don't know. Anyway, that could be significant for somebody here. But um, yeah, spending time out um, alone to yourself, okay? You could be uh, strongly connected to animals as well, All right? Somebody could be born within the years of 1946 to 64, all right? A baby boomer. You can also be an influencer, all right? Let's see what else comes out, though. Now I want to get these cards. Tell me what's going on here, please, for the collective Holy Spirit. All right, we have bird's eye view. So seeing the bigger picture here. All right, somebody could have underestimated you. Somebody name could be Christine, Christy, okay, Jasmine, all right, Yasmin, anything like that, okay? All right, but it says looked over, underestimated. There's something that you could have been overlooked, 
uh, or, you know, over looked, overlooked, yeah, overlooked for or uh, counted out, maybe, you know what I'm saying? That you're able to see a bigger picture now, all right, or something like that. Then you have gassing up someone's head, lying, sugarcoating, and then elbow, which is nudge and convincing. Give me a second. It's something about the view, not not receiving the, like, some sort of, it's something about not taking something personal here. You, some, the, the line and the nudge convincing, I'm very curious about that. All right, somebody that could be Greg, Gregory, okay? All right. Elaine, all right? All right, so my next thought with this. Holy Spirit, can you tell me about bird's eye view what is this about the queen of cups that's your energy pisces the nine of wands there's something about looking at certain situations events that have occurred in your past right in your past and telling yourself a new story, right? Gas your own fucking head up. You understand me? Lie to yourself if you do loo, -loo okay? And I mean that in the most, like, <laughs> in the best way possible, right? Like, no crazy, crazy shit. With 66 on the clock with 633, okay? All right, so you could be seeing at number 66. All right, but there's something about, like, convincing yourself not to lie to yourself to, like, I don't know how to explain that spirit. I don't know how to explain it. Let's see if anything else come out. Give me something for lying, gassing one's head up. <laughs> oh my God. This could even be visualization, scripting, things like that. That's what I mean by like lying or, you know, gassing your own self up or something like that, right? My nose is itching. So that could be significant for someone here. July the 17th could have been a significant date for you or it could be. Um, but it's giving me very much like scripting, right? And in scripting, what are you doing? You're writing out your script. Like for instance, a few years ago, I used to wake up every morning and I would write my day out and more times than not, my day would go according to my script. For instance, writing out, thank you God for this beautiful day. Everyone is so attracted to my beautiful energy. I find favor wherever I go. I always get the best parking spots. I am so grateful for this easy life that I live. Y'all, scripting, right? What none of that shit going on when I wrote it, but best believe it manifested because that's where my attention was directed towards, right? All right, so that could be significant for someone, but let's see what it what is here for. What's the gassing one's head up? <laughs> Why do I keep saying it like that? It's literally not written like this. So I don't know. Somebody could like try to talk fancy or some shit. Okay, have proper grandma. <laughs> All right, gassing up someone's head. Holy Spirit, lying, sugarcoating. All right, Toy Story could be someone's like favorite movie, childhood movie or something. All right, Andy, that name could be significant. Okay, all right, what was the dude's name? Uh, it was Andy, Buzz, Woody, that was the other one's name. Look, look, childlike energy, right? And what do you need? Well, shit. If you're a Pisces, you're ruled by Neptune. Shit, all you need is Neptune. You can visualize and daydream and all the rest of that shit all day long, right? But very much childlike energy, imagination. Uh, just imagine. I don't know, Barney could be significant too. Just imagine all the places we could see. Like all the imagination's fun for you and me, okay? Come on, spirit. Okay, what's this gas pump? All right, somebody like smoking weed. All right, that gas. Okay, all right. Oh, come on now. Come on now. Okay, four of wands. This is very, very, very much portal energy. Give me more of those, spirit. Come on, timelines. That's how you jump timelines, though, y'all. That's literally how you jump timelines. Let me write this down. All right. 
literally. How do you jump timelines? First of all, look, and then you balance this fudge, bro. Look at this. How freaking beautiful. Okay, October the 11th could be a significant date for someone this year. Okay. Y'all know something popped off with that Lionsgate portal and I don't know what's going on. I feel like someone is, a few of us are under some sort of transformation and the full manifestation of this transformation bars, right? <laughs> Will be around, uh, like, uh, October, the end of October, the beginning of November. Okay. Def is something about the day of the dead or Halloween time, all saints day, whatever your belief is. Okay. But like the 30th, 31st, November the 1st, the second, like something around that time, something is going to come into full, like into fruition fully for someone here. Okay. Definitely 11, 11. Okay. You see that 11, 11. Y'all go check your girl out on TikTok if you haven't already. This card came up in one of our readings today. I'll leave all the information in the description box or in the pinned comment, if not both, okay? But we have Pisces, Scorpio, Cancer energy on both, okay? All right, give me a second. Your intuition is leading you to some form of not just enlightenment, but it's giving me literally like a catap catapult, catapult, like something like pulling your ass back. You may have even had to go backwards a little bit, right? Maybe relearn some things, re-experience some things, something like that. Okay. Okay. All right. And, and, and you going back, all right, maybe taking a break, sitting that ass down real quick. Okay. This is preparing you for such a forward movement, motion, momentum, okay, to take you right through this graduation to the next level, I'm telling you, and you balanced AF, your masculine and your feminine energies and your emotional intelligence and maturity is balanced as well. This is beautiful. Come on, God, okay? I'm just saying. Shit. All right, Holy Spirit, what else, please? Patience, my God. That could even be somebody name, okay? Oh, my Lord, my baby on the bottom of the deck, y'all. Hey, Michael. All right, that name could be significant too. It says, now is the time to learn, study, and gather information. Enjoy being a student because in the future, probably, probably around like the end of November, early November. I mean, the end of October, early November, okay? Real talk. All right, because in the future, around that time, <laughs> you will synthesize your knowledge into action. It doesn't have to start then, y'all, but I feel like something is going to be made manifest around that time for a few of us, okay? I've been picking up on that energy since before the Lionsgate portal, all right? And that just came back to my, um, you know, my awareness just now. I am with you, says Archangel Michael, giving you the courage to make life changes, that will help you work on your divine life purpose. That's what this street view is giving me. All right. It said, well, the street is giving me, it says bird's eye view, right? So you could, and especially with, with the cups being here, the king and the queen of cups, this is psychic energy, period. Very intuitive energy right here, right? So you may be able to even see, you know what I'm saying? Possibilities for your timelines in the future. Or how do I say, uh, uh, multiple timeline possibilities how to say that spirit i hope it's making sense what i'm trying to say like you could possibly see like from a higher view right which comes through what meditation okay where did the lady go she she went back into uh, where, where, where she go We're talking about uh going outside and sitting down in the grass and shit like that and meditating but that comes through meditation mindfulness practices right staying in the present moment right you're able to get clarity okay right so it's something about seeing multiple ways to get to this destination whatever you do just don't be like the israelites and take 40 years to get to a destination that should only took taking your ass 11 days you can look that shit up google it i'm telling you the israelites could have gotten there in 11 days y'all 11 days it took them then just 40 fucking years right all right this is seeing something from the from above. You understand what I'm saying? From a higher perspective. Come through in, baby. Come through. 
What else, Spear? Okay, Michael wanna stay. No, that's Bridget. Bridget, Bridget, Bridget. It says caution is warranted. Look deeper into this situation before proceeding. What else, Spear? We're gonna definitely get into that. Then we have Teresa. Okay, so somebody could be pushing themselves a little bit too, too much. Okay. Look, it says time out now. Time out. You've been so busy taking care of everyone else's needs, but now it's time to stop and take care of yourself. Take care of yourself. Collect them. All right, let's see what Bridget's talking about. Like. Shanti, Shanti is on the bottom of the deck. Shanti said, I'm the angel of peace. A Leo could be significant. I bring you tranquility and a smoother road ahead. Okay. Let's see what Bridget's talking about. Holy Spirit. What Bridget talking about? What we need to be cautious about? We got justice. A Libra could be significant. All right. Justice on the bottom of the deck. What is this we need to be cautious about? Holy Spirit. Ninja. 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 Jesus. Oh, there is something here about somebody needs to sit down for a second. You see that? Be cautious. All right. We ain't, we don't look fear of missing out is it, the devil. That ain't shit, but the devil, this world is abundant. My ninja, you ain't missing out on shit. Okay. All right. And everything is cyclical. If it, if you missed the sale the first time, guess what? That whole going to come back around. You ain't missing nothing. Nah. It's something about that. Like, yes, we want to take action towards our goals and things like that. But what did this thing say? Teresa told your ass to sit down for a second. Now, don't be trying to move all fast. Take a break. Remember, the, the first lady told us, go sit outside. Go sit outside. Just calm down. Because everything is coming together here. All right? But, yeah, watch out for this ninja. Trying to make you rush. Make you feel like you, you're missing something. You know what I'm saying? You have, you have no... Noah. Fate. You can't miss fate, Ninja. You can't miss your destiny. Like I said, just like with the Israelites, they didn't miss that. Well, well, let me let me back the hell up. Cause some of them folks did die. Okay? And they damn the generations after them had to witness the promised land. You know what I'm saying? <clears throat> uh, but that was because they kept fucking up and doubting. Don't doubt. Have faith. Trust, look, trust, okay? Trust, you're being guided, okay? With love at that, you're being guided by love. What is God? God is love. You're being guided by God. Don't let this ninja come in and say, hey, collective, you know what I'm saying? Come here. No, ninja, we're not fucking with you. All right, so just be cautious about the devil. And what is the devil that's overthinking, overeating, over, over, overindulgence, right? Um, this could be obsessing, okay? Trying to control some shit that's beyond your control, right? Go, go listen to the serenity prayer or something. You know what I'm saying? That's the type of energy the devil bring to satisfy those lower three chakras. What is it? Food, lust, and is it greed or something like that? I forgot. I was just studying that shit last night, right? It's the lower self. Get that hoe in check. Tell it, sit down. We, 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 I got you. Okay? Okay. Hey, Mr. Devil Man. Mm -mm, you're not tying us up today, sir. We rebuke you, okay? Until you get your ass in your place. Which is underneath me. <laughs> Beneath me feet. Satan. Real talk. He be getting scared. He feel your energy when you're leaving him. So he want to throw shit out to you like, no, come here, baby. Come back to me, baby. Tell the devil go to hell. Okay. Any other questions for the collective here, Holy Spirit? The Queen of Swords. This, look. A trick of the mind, a trick of the enemy to fuck with your mind now. Overthinking, over, over worrying, <laughs> over worrying, worrying, period, period, period is a no-no. We don't worry because we trust and we know everything is coming together. You understand me? And all roads lead to our desired outcome. All right. Interesting. All right. Let's put these up here. Come here, y'all. Go right there. All right, don't forget to hit that like button for your girl, my loves. I appreciate you. All right, Holy Spirit. 
don't ignore the warning signs either now okay if your spirit team is sending you messages like let's say for instance i know the other day my spirit team told me hey yo blue i need well i ain't gonna use that example because that's kind of personal but <laughs> they told me to stop doing something to stop watching a particular something right that i was that i was watching and <laughs> i was literally i logged out of my main account on youtube right and went to another account and on that other account was the thing they told me not to not to indulge in anymore not right now right i clicked on that video y'all i kid you not how about my spirit team said fuck that shit literally as the video was coming on some kind of way the other account which is a totally different login the video from that account popped up on my my planet pisces account that i was watching youtube on houseway that was my angel team like didn't i tell your ass to stay away from this shit that's gonna have your mind fucked up 77 warning i'm warning that ass okay i'm trying to get your god dang mind away from this demon nah i'm just saying because i was obsessing over the shit you know what i'm saying they like bam, 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 ninja look at here now we even told that ass one time sit down sit down all right, Holy Spirit, anything else? Okay. Yo, yo, yo. This ninja coming to steal, kill, and destroy somebody's mind. Tell that ninja where to go, my ninja. Look, I, I mean, I need somebody here to look at something from a higher perspective, okay? This part is not for everybody, but I'm feeling something about victim consciousness here for someone. Okay, you, I don't know who that's for. This feel like for somebody specific, okay? You might want to look into like how to overcome victim consciousness. Like life is happening to you. No, it's happening for you. It's all about what? That higher perspective. No one's a victim. No, it's a, let me back that up, okay? Because I don't have time in the comments. Look, okay? Be whoever you want to be. <laughs> but I'm just giving you the warning here, okay? For whoever that's for. And if you say something in the comments, obviously it was for your ass. Okay? 2222 was on the clock when I just looked up. All right. But yeah, guard your mind. Guard the gates of your mind. Okay? Be cautious or, yeah, shit. Bridget said, be that ass cautious. Okay? <laughs> I don't know why that ass has been coming up so, so much lately. I don't know. Somebody might be an ass man, an ass woman. Okay? I don't know. All right. But yeah forms of enlightenment are coming towards you but you got to be open to receive this shit right had an open mind okay open look now nah. look now nah. okay all right now nah, don't let this ninja here fuck around okay and have you walking in the damn wilderness for 40 years messing with your mind all right climb the mountain okay all right see the 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 bigger view how do you climb the mountain like going up your spinal cord going up to heaven to the mind huh? mindfulness okay jacob's ladder the vertebrae come on go on to that to the top of the mountain that mind okay all right now i love you so very very much let me know your thoughts down below um in the comments all right now see y'all down there in the next video over on planet pisces or on tiktok at fairy god witch blue hit your girl up let me know you love me <laughs> all right my loves oh yeah quick shout out to the members of planet pisces over on our other channel we will be having our live tonight for members only at 6 p.m central standard time it is not too late to join planet pisces you don't have to be a pisces you can just love me okay <laughs> love our community okay all right we all have a 12th house right okay which is ruled by pisces so yeah come through you know what i'm saying we're gonna have our live tonight and it's gonna be lit my ninja so i'll see y'all i love you my babes see y'all later